you see this video right here it is from a channel that is just one month old on youtube with no shorts just long form videos just one single post on the community tab but look at the amount this channel has gotten look at the number of watch hours look at number of views the number of subscribers isn't it mind-blowing now i went ahead to chat gpt just to help every one of you chat gpt come here give me practical honest strict ways that would get youtube to recommend the video of a person that just started out on youtube and the person is getting like 10 views on his channel what are practical ways that would make this person's channel go viral immediately now these are the things i'm going to be sharing with you on today's video now let's get right into it do not miss out on any information because i'm going to be showing you practical ways how to use different tools if it worked for this channel it would definitely work for your own channel Set first understand how youtube recommends videos YouTube recommends content that number one has a high CTR, meaning gets people to click. Don't worry, I'm going to show you how to do all of these things on your videos, okay? Number two, gets people to watch longer. Number three, gets people to engage, like with likes, comments, shares. Number four, is relevant to the current search of viewer behavior. You see this number four? I'm going to be very, very practical. I'm going to show you my screen, how you can actually do this. And guys, you will be wowed because it works for every niche here's what the person must practically do now the first one it says niche down like a laser now it says don't be general be very specific with your niche for example if it's your lifestyle vlog you don't want to just do lifestyle vlogs it says instead do affordable skincare routines for dark skin or that's if you're in that kind of niche or you do ai tools for beginner youtubers like you are really niching down in a very specific way it said that youtube does not recommend unknown creators unless it knows what problem they solve or who they are serving just yesterday i met a particular okay well not just yesterday but i spoke with him in depth yesterday guys this guy just started his youtube channel a month ago and this guy has made almost three thousand dollars from youtube that is to tell you that it's not just about you being a new content creator. It's about you doing this, the right things you should do. Now, the second one, it says, make search-based videos first. Titles, descriptions, and tags should target what people are actively searching for. Now, this is where we go practical. Use tools like TubeBuddy, VidIQ, or free Google Trends to find low competition keywords. Example, instead of my YouTube journey begins, go with how to start a youtube channel in nigeria you now put in bracket 2025 guide now let me show you how to use these tools first you want to go over to your browser and type google trends now when you type google trends you're going to see this place that says explore you want to go ahead and type in whatever it is that you want to check okay now i went ahead to type in how to make youtube recommend your videos and then look at the graph that it's brought out after i search tapped on search interest over time with the dates also then you see where it says compare type in another title name do you understand here i typed in how to get 1000 subscribers now when i searched it look at the comparison note that the first one has blue color the second one has red the next one is tube body just tap on it and link your channel then go over to tag explorer Ta this is what i usually use just type in the name of the topic you want to use then you can look at the competition and then look at keywords tags that you can use in your video the next one is to go over to vidiq the same thing go to where you have keywords type the keyword you want to use but what i usually use here is the title that i want to use and then i compare the overall score the search volume and then i see also tags and keywords that i can use the third one it now says you go ahead to design thumbnails and titles for your ctr now it says ctr is your click click through rate which is very very critical right it says use bold text contrast close-up facial expression be minimalistic be minimalistic in the sense that you don't want to crowd your thumbnails do you understand three words very okay four words that would easily get straight to the point and let people know okay this is what they are getting is okay if you are using your facial expressions let it be close to the camera and also if you go into your youtube studio you are also going to see a place where when youtube is telling you your weekly recap you're you going to see a place where youtube is going to compare your thumbnails with the thumbnails of other content creators very very important always take note of that particular part okay because it will help your channel now the next thing it now says go ahead and create strong hook in your first 30 seconds guys go back 
and watch the first 30 seconds of this video then come and continue so you understand what i mean youtube watches viewer drop off start videos with a clear hook so it now puts in brackets what they will get so start your videos by telling people exactly what they will get in that video i've told people that you don't want to just do suspense 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 let people know you can start your suspense in a strategic way from the beginning you can give put people on suspense by even telling them what they will get do you understand so you're just telling them it's not like you're already showing them how to get it but you're already telling them this is what you're going to get in this video then fast pacing let your first 30 seconds be fast even if you're someone that talks slowly you can start that first 30 seconds in your normal way then when you're editing increase the speed of that first 30 seconds so that you can quickly get people see people humans have a low attention um span of visual or text engagement you'll notice that even as i'm filming i'm giving putting visuals um b-rolls i'm putting text all those things they keep viewers engaged if they click but they drop off youtube stops recommending that is the truth if a person clicks on your video and the person now goes ahead to just click off youtube will stop recommending that particular video i noticed that on one of one video that i uploaded one time like that because people were clicking but dropping off youtube the video did not get as much views as it should have gotten right do you understand so that is one thing you want that video to be your videos to be very engaging if it's not engaging even if you know so well about youtube you, you still not go that far do you understand it now says post consistently for four to eight weeks now this is how you're going to do it it says even with great content youtube needs data to know who your audience is if you attended in fact not just my last class if you've been on my channel you understand this particular thing that youtube uses your data it is what you give youtube that youtube will give you back that is a simple truth and that's why i tell people do not give up on youtube because you might give up at that on the verge of going viral post one to two quality videos per week consistently for two months no short cuts. that is just it consistently if it's just one or two quality videos that you can post do that now the sixth one it says engage with viewers deeply ask questions in your video i've said this if you also attended my last class you also know that i mentioned it there ask questions in your videos reply to every comment guys one thing i can tell you to do let me take off my glass is if you're replying to comments sometimes you can even use you can use your own self to ask question go to youtube on your friend's phone and then search for your own channel search for that video place comments there on your friend's phone increase the pace the speed of the video and quickly run through the video place comments then go back to your own phone respond to that comment just do it for about three five friends just use it to keep viewers engaged on your videos but ensure that when you are using those friends devices to watch your own you want to ensure you are subs you subscribe to your channel on their phones do you understand because youtube actually takes note of your viewer engagement takes note of what the other type of videos that they watch so the thing good thing is if youtube says that they subscribe then that means youtube will take it that okay this person is actually interested in your own video do you understand the logic now pin helpful comments i used to do this thing when i started my channel initially i'll just go ahead to people that you know comments that people made that are very very good out that would even encourage other people i'll go ahead and pin those comments so you want to start doing those things you can you can pin one of the comments one of your friends comments this youtube thing has to do with psychology as long as people can see that oh someone watched it and it got them this kind of value for them to be able to paste this comment they want to watch that video too and this triggers higher engagement signals and the second to the last one it says analyze what works and double down go to your youtube studio go to content go to sorts by views and ctr so you can go to your desktop version go to youtube studio then go to where you have content then go to where you have sorts by views and ctr find out the video that did best even if it is small it will it in brackets even if it is small make two to three related videos around that topic i have said this over and over again then the last one it says don't rely on shots only because i have been seeing people doing this thing on their channels i will be reviewing their channels and will see that these people post just mainly shorts on their channels and when i ask them that okay is it just from shorts that you want to be earning they'll say no from long form videos and i'm like how and you're not posting the long form videos so do not rely on shorts only shorts may go viral but long form videos are what actually build recommendation momentum shorts will just bring in awareness but long form videos brings loyalty and revenue that is actually the truth it now says final truth drum roll <laughs> if the content isn't solving a problem if it's not entertaining if it's not adding value clearly youtube will not recommend it no matter how hard you work focus first on real value 
optimize your packaging see packaging matters even outside of youtube see the way you package yourself ah the same thing goes with your channel the way you package your, your channel matters a lot okay so it now says and study what works don't just post what feels good to you study what actually your pe people want to watch now it says do you want me to help you craft a beginner friendly growth plan or video idea for that person so i said yes and give me one mind-blowing um video idea and if you know that you want that you want to go over to my instagram i'm glorious on instagram just say hi i'm from your video i want that video idea and i'll send it to you immediately for free do not forget i take both youtube and video editing one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions if you need me to help you with that just chat me up on instagram and let me know or you just go on my seller store to book a package with me and i'll see you on my next one do not forget to watch this video very important information you have there bye for now